Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperium Galactic Survival. This is your host Zelot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 11 series of the Invader Defender Senate. Whoa! Yeah, don't open that yet. There's a creepy crawly underneath the CV, so we. Uh, I'll let you in on what happened. So, I was. Flying into the Polaris area to mine, like I said, is gonna. And I forgot the turret was on, and it was. I haven't set it up yet. And you can see it is set for Predator. It started firing at freaking something. Hit one of their buildings. I'm no, I'm not kidding. It didn't even hit whatever it was firing at. Uh, hit one of the buildings and instantly I went neutral with the freaking. I turned off the turret so at least we didn't like continue to get nuked by rep. But that hurt us because we were already friendly. We were like into friendly by a bit. Thank God we hadn't have done any of the rep faction gain missions yet. So I was able to get two of those done really quickly they're just they're they're it wasn't worth showing you guys you guys have probably seen these a million times privacy matters shut down some now that one it was a little tricky to do but and the wildlife can't cam super easy okay uh the privacy matters the how i did that one because there is no initial find the location um you can just come into here and check it to proceed into the next thing and then when I did that drone spawn thank God I was in the SP and I just shot them down but <clears throat> the drone spawned I shot them down I got credit for that one I got credit for the other one just by being at going to different ores and mining them so that was pretty trivial um, but unfortunately and then I went and killed a bunch of Xerox working on my Talon faction which is also helping with the polaris but the polaris is still neutral Oof. it's a long haul i've really made a big dent in the talon though i'm almost almost out of unfriendly um and we're gonna get out of unfriendly from talon before we get into friendly with polaris because when you kill xerax you get 125 talon and only 75 polaris so but what it meant is I've been killing a bunch of stuff. I got 19th level, so we've got a ton of points to spend wherever we want. We And because I did go out mining, we got... Um, I had to put it all in here because it was getting quite heavy. Um, yeah, we got mass amounts, some silicone, iron, copper. I actually ran out of iron, so I was like, oh. Uh, making 15 mil bullets so um, so I stopped killing the Xerox and then went on a mining spree here so that's what we came up with here we can dump that in there actually I think yeah that's fine and I just have a little bit of each ore except for cobalt gotta go get some cobalt before we leave the planet or we get it at the moon I think got it um, but I'd rather just get it on the planet here because there's some really close yeah <laughs> but I also want to check out this unknown structure and we also have to kill stupid dude underneath us so let's deal with the stupid dude underneath us the tentacle monster where is he there he is. Oh, really? Wow, he is super tough. <laughs> okay. I mean, sure, I was shooting him in the, right up the wazoo. Really? Really? Thank, thanks for that, guys. That's awesome. <laughs> he literally has a wazoo. <laughs> Okay, um, 
let's deal with okay this is going to be scary because they're going to come at me and those freaking doors well i'll be able the doors will open i'll be able to run in but they're going to get ahead they're going to headbutt me these horrors so let's um there can we i don't have a shotgun should actually just make a shotgun You know what? Let's just do this. There, let's... You know what I'm going to do right now? I'm going to go like this. See if we can get pot shots off of them. Oh! Ah, oh, great. Now they're underneath, right? Yeah. Oh! Really need a shotgun for these guys. It's better. Come on, buddy. I don't think he's coming. Okay, so if I jump out onto the top of their building, you think? Might work. Oh, that was <laughs> that was some good jumping. Oh, buddy, he's stuck under my thing. Okay, that sucks. Oh no, he isn't. Oh, there was were some good BP hits. They can't get up here, can they? Okay, let's um. You know what? Maybe I just gotta like totally train them and run around. Let's try it. <laughs> oh, they're right there! Headshot! 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 No! 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 Don't kill me! Oh, killed one of them. Got them both! Yay! <laughs> <sighs> that was a nightmare. Level 4. This planet's kind of tough. Let's see what they were guarding. And probably, you know what? Let's take out the core here. Okay. Nice. We can get some Xeno substrate from this building if we want. <gasps> Ooh, medical device. Good. A little bit of ore. A restroom zascosium that we don't actually have. Uh, you know what? We'll just um, dump that into... No, that's not where I wanted that. I wanted that into there, and then we're going to go... Yeah, we'll dump that into there, and then those into there. Okay. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. The medical device, I can put a... Uh, I'll put a medical station in here, and that way we can clone. I'll put it right here. It's going to eat up some CPU, but I think it'll be a good thing to have. Let's do it. How much CPU is it? doesn't say okay well I guess we just got to put it down and we'll find out okay so how do we find out if we hit P and then okay, I'm not sure I'm not sure what the CPU is on it it's not showing any that couldn't be right. It's got to, obviously, do we have to group it? You know what? We can auto-group. We don't have any special grouping set up yet on this little piece of crap. So, um, eh, okay. 
Well, I don't know. That's weird. That's really weird. Let's check. Um, does it say in here? Okay. Armor locker. Ventilator. Wireless. Medical devices. Okay. So we just got a medical device kit for two. Two CPU. Okay. Not really a big hit then. Not didn't even budge the number there. We're we're a little bit inefficient on this thing, but not so bad. Not so bad. We're only like five percent off. That's not bad. Okay. Good. Yay! I can make this my home now. Yay! That's huge. Well, we got what we want out of that. Let's grab the cobalt just over here. So I've been on a mad mining mission here. And you can see, what's it going to give us it, going straight up? 48, not bad with all that weight. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. Yeah, because we ain't doing any any exploity um, distribute the weight on our free free weight on a toolbar thingy right now. So that's its real numbers. I think we can land here. Oh, the thrusters turned off. That's a good sign. Okay. Nice. Right below us. So we can just stand here then. We can just stand here even. I mean, I designed it so that when you jump out, well, it kicks you to the side, but you can just spin around, spawn your drone. Actually, you know what? Here, let's try. I just sorry. <laughs> I wanted to see how this thing performs if I just try spinning like this and sp and spawning the drone. Yep, it works. Okay, good. That's what I thought. I just yeah, nice. I don't even have to move. I just have to spin a bit. Like it. I like it. Okay, let's grab this cobalt. So it's medium. Um. I won't bore you with mining out the whole thing here. We'll get it started. Oh, that's an interesting texture for it. It's really slow digging it. It's funny, uh, the... Every ore seems to be a little bit different on how fast you can dig it. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but I, I've i noticed that. Like, this is... I don't know, it just seems to be slower. <laughs> It's like some ores you that it it only takes about half the amount of time to to do the to do the chunk of ore thing, right? To take the chunk. It'd be really bad, really slow with it. Here, let's see what the survival tool's like. <laughs> no, I'm not going to. Yeah, it's weird. It's just some ores dig faster than others. I guess that makes sense, right? Different densities. Okay. I still got 80% left. I'm not going to bore you guys digging out the rest of this on camera. <laughs> I will spare you guys that. So... Um, 
I'll come grab you when we actually get back to the base and have the SV all loaded back up with bullets because this episode we're not going to space. I have to recover from that serious blow here. We're going to go kill Xerax like crazy. So we're going to like, <laughs> that's why I'm getting all, that's why I went and got this iron too for all the, um, um, all the 15 mil bullets were just pff, eating through the iron like butter. Okay, uh, I will see you in a bit. All right. So, uh, we did a whole ton of mining. I'll see, I'll show you what we got here now. Uh, da -da -da, the Cargo 7, and so yeah, you can see we're, we're not going to run out of ammo anytime soon. Um, yeah, I just, the, the, I had to go mine all this up. <laughs> so I think we're going to be good for a while, um, with the basic ores, you know, not sure. I'm not sure if six, you know, 6,000, eight, 8,000 iron and, you know, 6,000 copper is enough, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, that was actually two medium deposits or one large and one medium I think for the iron and one large for the copper and one large or medium for the silicone I can't remember it was just one deposit for the silicone one deposit for the cobalt one deposit for the copper and two for the iron yeah okay uh, oh also promethium yes we got a bunch of promethium and I've made a bunch of fuel. Now I've made a shit ton of bullets, as you can see. I loaded them into the scout, and the reason why I've done that is because we still we 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 got to crank on this. We're gonna try and get to neutral, so let's try and do that right now. Uh, I brought us over beside the Xerax because there's actual troops that spawn around the drone base so we can just keep killing them um yeah i mean basically that's that's what we're gonna do i got no food on me eh? okay it's probably not a good idea you never want to leave anywhere without any sort of food on you a couple couple pieces uh power bar the good enough Okay, let's grab our SP. This is kludgy. Oh, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Slid right off. Oh, and now I can't get back up. What the heck? Come on. Why isn't it? Okay. You know what? It's probably because it's tilted. Let's try the other side. <laughs> is that the case? Yep, that's the case. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, why am I sliding off? I wasn't sliding before. Okay, we should be able to get up there. Uh, and just barely, yep. <laughs> okay, that's kludgy, I know. This isn't meant to be transport of, of an SVE, really. It's not really. I guess we could put an elevator up or something. I don't know. Maybe off the side or back, maybe. Yeah, an elevator. Oh, hey, like a, like a Winnebago. We could put like a, <laughs> like a freaking ladder. Yeah, no, that's cheese. Uh, although kind of practical at this point. Anyway, let's, uh, oh, you know what? I really need some more bottom thrust, but right now we got enough. We've got enough to uh, take on the Xerax. Where am I going? I'm going the wrong way. That's where I'm going. This is Xerax Island. It's the only Xerox POI on the planet. Um, happens to be a drone base, which is defunct. It doesn't it doesn't spawn drones. 
It doesn't send drones out to deposits. It doesn't send them out to attack. Um, so for a drone base, it's kind of pathetic. <laughs> but uh, uh, it does defend itself. And troops do spawn. So let's take a look. Let's see if we can find. Oh, uh, you know what? It's a. It's about to get dark out. God, my time. Oh, see, there's there's troops. They just spawn in. I just saw them spawn in. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Ooh, we got lots of ammo. Problem is, is this thing's so twitchy with the one RCS that it's hard when they're moving to actually hit them really hard. Oh, nice! He walked right in, right into my freaking crosshairs. So you can see I'm getting 125 Talon and 75 Polar... What? No, it should have been more than that. It didn't look like it was getting enough. Oh, we are getting... Yeah, it's, it's climbing slowly. Um, now, looting them is really freaking dangerous. Last time I jumped out and looted, uh, more spawned like right away on me. I almost got a rocket up the yin yang. Oh, and see, there's a guy down there. He's gonna be lippy. He's gonna come at us. Come on. Die. Oh my god. Just die. Thank you. Yeah, I need more upward thrust. The weight of this thing is slowing it down. Even though it's got really nothing to it. Some cargo. So what this is doing for us, it's, we're getting rep. We're getting rep for Talon. We're getting rep for Polaris. Because, you know, we got screwed by our turret. And we're getting XP. Which we need to hit level 25 to do the quests. And, you know, once we get level 25, everything's unlocked. So it's just a matter of getting all the ingredients together. Okay. I don't see... Any immediately there's the drone base over there we'll get a little closer to it it's usually this place is usually just swarming with them I got to be careful of rocket Xerox they have they have a really good range same with the uh, laser Xerox they have a very good range also Come on, I know you exist. Just killed some of you. <laughs> Usually there's so many of them that I wonder if it's because it's at night. Would that actually make a difference? It's I think it should make a difference for Xerox spawns, but maybe. And last time I came over these hills, there were a lot of Xerox running at me with freaking guns. I don't see any. Oh, 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 here we go. Here we go. We're getting some. We're getting some.
like I say, the goal for this episode is to make neutral at the Talon. Come on. Shoot his buddy, he's not moving. This guy's running around. It's a freaking dodgeball king, I tell you. Can I loot him? Can I loot him? I might be able to actually loot him. I know I'm really close to the drone base. But it can't shoot because its turrets are too low. Oh, no. See, I'm not looting them. There's just... I can't get down to the bodies usually. There's just too many Xerax around. Level 20. Nice. Little freaking level five SB. Taking on the galaxy with a freaking starter SB. That's that's how you do it. Like a boss. said that like forever for those of you Lonely Island fans out there okay oh 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 what was that little flash ah uh, one of these guys shooting at me this guy Mr. Laser. Mr. Laser. I mean, that'd be a good source of... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Too many Xerox around to, to land, though. It's just too dangerous to land. Dodgeball Kings now. Oh, crap. A little too close. Maybe jump. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, shit. <laughs> that. Okay. <laughs> not, not fucking cool. What the hell? Oh my god, ouch, 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 ouch. Who shot a rocket at me, you bastard? It wasn't you, you're too far away. <laughs> it's funny, because my, my core on this thing is like totally exposed on the bottom, too. Oh, uh, wow. Bloody hell. Okay, we're getting a little close. <laughs> Don't want that thing shooting at us. Let's head back over here. Let's see what kind of shenanigans. See, there's a shenaniganer there. That might be the shenaniganer. No, but. See, I had a rocket shoot at me. Where the frick did that rocket come from? Ah! Do I spot the rocketers? Let's... I really need to upgrade this thing. And the one RCS is too much for it. <laughs> but without an RCS on, I can't point down. 
I can do everything else, but I can't point down. So it's really, I can only, I have to, I have to like do a loop de loop to, <laughs> to point down. Okay. Oh, you're gonna be cheeky. Oh, you're a laser, dude. Ah. Oh, neutral with the talon. Yes, yes, yes. I'm still quite a way to go to be neutral with the, or to be friendly with the players, which is really disappointing. Come on! Oh my god. Oh, these these guys are jeez, it's right in the face. <laughs> ow, 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 you bastard. They're little dodgeball. They're like dodgeball kings with a wicked Wicked freaking ball that's hard to dodge and they throw it at you. Okay, I'm gonna lose some thrusters soon if we take another hit. I get a little nervous here. God, look at all the Xerox. It's just like it's like crawling, the mountain is crawling with them like ants. Ugh. They are just so hard to hit. <laughs> it's just... There. <sighs> okay, so we're, we're neutral with the talent. We're neutral with... Let's just head over here and, like, repair up. Wow, the drone base really has some some long reach, doesn't it, for uh, creating a zone? Okay, let's park up here for a second. We'll suss everything out and call it an episode. Get that a little lined up a little better. There we go. That's good. Okay. Let's see what happened to her. She's not looking that beat up. Hmm. I mean, I did take a... Oh. It shot me and it almost popped my eyes out. Gosh darn. Uh, thruster hurt. Mm, yeah. So, I mean... We took damage. It's just not as much as you'd expect. Oh. Oh, yeah. That took some damage. Okay, so. One more hit, and I think we could have been blown out of our cockpit. Okay. Well, not too, too bad. I mean, it could have been a lot worse. We could have, we could have lost some blocks. Okay, let's take a look at how we did here. Uh, so we're, we are now neutral with the Talon, which is fantastic. And we've, we've already, we're into 4,000 already. We're less than 2,000 away from becoming friendly with, with the Polaris, so that's excellent. I think what I'm going to do off camera is I'll go shoot up the player zone critters because you got way more, uh, but it'll just be specific Polaris um, rep, and I was trying to grind Talon rep so that, you know, so now uh, I need to get friendly with them, but I bet you 
we can now do yeah see predators are room return and so we if we activate this it'll give us like more rep um yeah i mean if we if we do these uh gotta be friendly for that so friendly for a bunch of these honored okay epic gift wow that's some money push your reputation for all three factions to 3,000 honored and fly to the galactic train and talk with the three re get your epic gift huh I don't I didn't know is this new this must be all new okay well this is cool let's activate this we should be able to do that uh, kill predators <laughs> 10 predators okay well that's going to be easy enough um i think what i'm going to do though is is i'm going to go kill predators in the um in the polaris zone uh and so just i'm just going to fly back to the to the trading station i think yeah let's do that let's do that so we'll Try and get back in here without getting eaten by a monster, and we'll call it an episode. So I'm going to fly back to the trading post and uh, start killing a bunch. I'm going to have the turret turned off, obviously. Turrets off. Freaking, I don't even know how they got turned on in the first place. When I jumped in, started flying, also my turret shoots a Freaking Polaris piece. Uh. <sighs> Serenity now. Well, guys, I'm going to leave the episode here. We will uh, get a little bit long in the tooth, actually. Um, next episode, we should have... I'm going to grind all the Polaris rep back to friendly. And uh, we should have... Um, enough stuff made to hopefully make buy another uh thingy majiggy <laughs> and uh yeah yeah then we'll have two thingamajiggies so until then you guys have yourself an awesome awesome day